Hi everyone and welcome back to the shed. I'm Ryan and today we're going to be doing another unboxing year on RC Fun and Games and this one is one I have been looking forward to since last year. I saw so much about this rig, I heard so much about this rig and of course it's the first one of its kind. This is a brushless 1 to 18 scale Fury Wagon and guys I think this is gonna be one of the best RC cars that I've unboxed of the small scale stuff. So let's get it open. Let's have a quick look around because I believe this thing comes really well set up straight from the factory. So let's get it open and have a really good look at what we get. Oh, well that's so we get our instructions, charger, wrenches, front bumper, get a whole bunch of goodies in there. So let's have a quick look in here. This is how it comes packaged. Just got the foam block sitting on top. Yeah, this is interesting. So just the car like that, control all loose. And of course, another styrofoam block that was keeping it off the bottom. Very simply packaged. I like the way that is. Let's just have a look at this rig. Look at that. That looks amazing. What a cute little car. Check that out. This is awesome. But before we open up that, let's just grab the controller. Let's get that open. And of course, it comes with the awesome four channel controller. I love these controllers. They come out on many rigs and they are really cool. Of course, you've got your fourth and third channel up here and nice and easy to adjust according to the way you want to play. But we don't need to do any of that because I believe we've got a Bluetooth app so that we can set up the system on this truck. So that's something we'll definitely have to look into. Now, let's get this truck unwrapped because this thing is too nice looking to be wrapped underneath this plastic. And of course, this is my favorite part. So let's get this off. Wow. Oh, the rigs are always so nice when they're brand new. Check that out. I've got to say, I do like the flame job they've done on this. This thing looks amazing. Check it out. They even managed to make quite a nice little bed for it. I do like the lights on the top of the truck. And I can see they've got cables, so we know they're functional. Very, very cool looking little body. Now, one thing I do not like is the fact that we've got four pins to take this body on and off. So this might be something I will be changing in the future. Besides that, I already love the look of this truck. So let's get these out. I always find these little blocks of foam handy, especially if you work with pins. Having one of these around, you don't lose your pins. Anyway, let's get this thing open. Let's see what it looks like inside. Okay, so the lights are plugged in. Let's get them unplugged. Oh, kind of stuck behind another wire. There you are. So there's our little body. Just comes with a little tab so you can connect your lights looks awesome now let's have a look at this chassis look at that wow i gotta say that's quite thick really nice built really really nicely built i love how it's got so many places that you can adjust your links loads of places for your shocks to go so you can adjust your system the way you want it i am really liking this and these big bore shocks do look awesome straight out of the box they, they don't feel great yeah, they don't push up at all so definitely i'm gonna have to address the shocks a little but it does feel like it's really well set up to get out and crawl with it so let's have a look at this tiny tiny little venom outrunner motor that is tiny I, I don't think i've ever seen something that small in a rig wow that is really impressive don't forget this is all very new to me I have never dealt with a brushless system. The only brushless system I've played with is on one of my little drift cars. And that's nothing compared to this. You can see this is way better set up. And of course, we get our 650 milliamp 2S battery, which it seems that we get quite a few parts shared with the CR-18 platform. These beadlock and tires look the same as the vans and the Unimog. Another thing I notice is definitely the portal axles are also shared with the same platform so in that sense i'm very happy because i know that these portal axles are extremely strong and good the tires and rims perform really well straight out of the box so i've got no complaints there 
This chassis is really impressive. They must have done quite a bit of work to engineer this. This is really, really a nice looking chassis. Now, I know that we do get a bumper in here so we can fit to the rig, but I am probably gonna save this nice looking little body and I think I've got something else I'm gonna be fitting to this. But for now, we are gonna run it with the original body, but I have got plans for this rig. Now, let's just talk a little bit about what we get on the truck here. And if I'm not mistaken, we've got the Venom Outrunner brushless motor. We have got the Lizard Pro ESC, which everybody seems to really like. So I'm really looking forward to giving all this a try. Now, I know that these controllers are awesome. So coupled to this system, I'm assuming we are gonna have a really, really good modulation. Okay, now that we've spoken about all the cool stuff that comes on this rig, I think it's time we get some batteries in the controller, throw the body back on, go and charge it up so we can go and do some tests around the backyard course. But before I run away, I just wanna say, thanks for watching and please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. It really, really helps my small little channel out. Now, let's get going. Let's go and test this thing out. And of course, I'm gonna test this without changing any of the settings on the app and I'm not gonna touch the rig. I'm gonna run it just the way it is so we can see how it performs. So let's get out, let's go and give it a test and I'll see you all on the next video.